What's up, guys? It's Myrtle Man. Today, I'm joined by TMC. And Hello. And today, we are going to be touring the 215th Street Station. TMC partially helped uh, with contributing to building this station. So, uh, as you can see, we now have the new topography feature within the world. As I mentioned in a community post, I wanted to start including terrain elevation. So, uh... This one is about, uh, let's see, so uh, right there, so if you see where that hill slopes down, uh, the very bottom of that is sea level. So it looks like it's going up 3, 6, 9, 12, and it keeps going up 15. So it looks like we're about 15 feet above sea level here. Uh, that might be 18, I might have missed one. So uh, yeah, it looks like we're about 18 feet, I, no, I think it was 16. I think this exact spot was 16 feet above sea level. Uh, so we're about 16 feet above sea level here, but since it's Minecraft, you have to round them off. So this is probably 15. That's what I would have rounded it down to. So, uh, yeah, here we are at 215th Street. Uh, first Manhattan station of the series. So uh, I am going to change the rules of the series to allow me to build any station that I want within the line. So we're still sticking to the one line, but I can now build any station I want along the line. Uh, just to spice things up a bit, you know, so uh, Here we are. There's the mezzanine up there. Uh, it's a red station house uh, original IRT designs up there. So uh, here's the downtown side. So downtown then at 200 and 15th Street station One if we go up the stairs here, we can head up to the platform And uh, you can see down over there to Broadway. We're above 10th Avenue over here. And uh, then over here you have the metro card machine or the ticket machine right there. Then uh, entry to the one uh, downtown. So you can go through the turnstile there. And uh, you can see there's sort of a brick floor here. It's sort of an orange red color right there. So then we can go through the doors here. And uh, here we are at the platform. Uh, interesting platform, especially with the northbound side over there. But uh, we'll have a look at that a little later. So uh, over here we can see it uses a similar design to 238th Street with uh, the steel plated walls over there. Then if we go over here we can see there is a bit of a slope uh, towards the northern end of the platform, but uh, it doesn't affect the platform itself. There is a slope at the southern end. I'll show you guys that in a minute. Uh, over here there's a sign 215th Street. Then it has these lamps. Uh, these were unique to this station. So uh, these are a new piece over there. And uh, you can see the ceiling over there, pretty nice design, I'd say. And of course, it just says 215th Street over there. Then uh, if we head down here, there are benches right there. You can sit on the benches and see out as you wait for the train. Then, of course, you have the 215th Street name signs along the wall over there. Then uh, you can head south over here. And uh, below us is 214th Street. You can see more of a slope there. And the station does follow that slope over here. And it does slope towards the southern end of the platform. And then you can see that there is a bit of a basin there uh, between hills. And it does slope over there. And then it slopes back up a little bit to 207th Street. So uh, let's just play the announcement here. This is a South Ferry bound one train. The next stop is 207th Street. So you can see that the next stop south is 207th Street. So now let's cross over and see the uptown platform or the northbound platform, depending on which you prefer to call it. And, uh, let's go through here, waiting for TMC. There we go. And uh, exit 215th Street and 10th Avenue. The other side doesn't have those exit signs because I, I think that the exits there must have been converted at some point. They're uh, very strange uh, on the other side. So uh, if we cross 10th Avenue over here, over to the other side. Uh, over here, this is where the yard will go. Or, uh, the yard will go. Uh, right down there, you can see there's an elevation drop over here for the yard and uh, part of the yard is below sea level so that's cool and uh, here we go the uptown side right there and uh, we can enter uptown 
215th Street Station, the Bronx. This font is actually different in real life, so that's why it's not using Helvetica there. You can see it's a different sign. So, uh, yeah, uh, that's weird, but uh, they did that. They do that sometimes. It seems like that's the new thing for the signs. Then you have exit there and uh, down arrow. Since uh, we only had two blocks worth of space here, I just put these down arrow exit signs. Then, of course, you can get a minecart there at those ticket machines. Then you have emergency exits there, and uh, we can enter through here. So, uh, as I mentioned, uh, it's a weird exit, sort of like a converted exit. So, we can come through there, and, uh, yep, so uh, that's how those work. And uh, exit there, and uh, here we are on the other side. So, we can see the other platform is uh, similar to the other one, but slightly offset as the IRT built those originally like that then of course you can see the same hill you can see it's a pretty steep hill over there to Broadway and what is that 212th Street looks like yeah might uh, goes up a bit there and then it goes back down uh, so that one was pretty high up relative to this but wait till you see 191st Street then it's really high up then of course you have another bench on this side so that's cool. There's your bench. And we go over here towards the northern end of the uptown platform. There's a sign over there. West 216th Street. And the uptown announcement. Um, let's try that again. There we go. This is a Bronx bound one train. The next stop is Marble Hill 225th Street. So uh, yeah, uh, Marble Hill is the next north. Uh, we'll get back to that one a little later. And uh, you can see the tops of the station houses over there. Uh, th sort of the reason why I'm adding uh, a rule that says, or a rule change that says that you can randomly pick stations along the lines because uh, although these stops are cool, they're sort of the same stop uh, to an extent, uh, especially with elevated stops. This is a problem. So, uh, yeah, I figured that it would be best to add that uh, rule change there. So, uh, TMC is making his way back over here. Looks like he got a little bit lost there uh, within the mezzanine. And uh, so, yeah, uh, that'll do for uh, this tour of 215th Street. Um, this video probably won't have a history segment in it. And uh, that's because, uh, well, I don't think you need it for every station. It's more so when you're introducing a new area. That it becomes relevant but of course if it's relevant to the station if there's something interesting that happened at the station then I will include a history segment and of course you can see over there uh, I did start the yard uh, that'll do for 215th Street on the one if you're new then remember to subscribe to my channel and uh, TMC's channel I'll link it below since he did help a little bit with this station uh, I did most of it but uh, yeah he helped a bit so uh, make sure to leave a like and leave a comment, even if you don't have much to say. Uh, it helps with the uh, algorithm. Um, I wonder if saying algorithm is bad for the algorithm, but uh, yeah, it helps with that. So uh, yeah, I've been Myrtle Man, joined by TMC, and I am saying goodbye. Thanks for watching.